There are three types of speeches in this world. There is the persuasive speech, the informative speech, and the entertaining speech. The public speaking world says that there are these three, but I would argue that there is only one, and that is the persuasive speech. You see, when you're giving an informative speech, you are persuading your audience that your information is relevant. And when you're giving a speech meant to entertain, you are persuading your audience that your voice deserves to be listened to. Like everyone else, I want my voice to be heard. And like every other woman out there, I have to fight for that. So that is why today I am going to be talking about Lily Singh. You see, Lily Singh is the first woman since Joan Rivers 30 years ago to host a late night show on a network television show. This is such an accomplishment and it is super exciting. While Lily might not seem to be trying to persuade us of anything, she truly is. Lily Singh is persuading the world that women deserve to be seen that women deserve to be funny, that women deserve to be seen being funny, that they deserve this prime time spot on television. So she's there, she's making it. How is she keeping it going? First of all, Lily is young and hungry. She goes at it full force, super high energy. She is completely her own person. Speaking of that, she gives it her own personal twist. Lily makes it personal, and this personal aspect makes for a cohesive show that is different from any other show on the market right now. And lastly, Lily inspires hope. Her show is not just about being funny, it truly has a mission. Let's start off by talking about that amazing energy that Lily has. From the moment she hits the stage, she is fun, energetic, completely and unashamedly herself. This means that when a guest comes on the show, she is dancing and encouraging them to be totally relaxed. And when they're talking, she is leaning in and she's motioning with her hands and she's exclaiming when they say something that excites her. And when she's finished with her segment, she looks at her DJ and tells him to hit that beat. So, there is never a dull moment with Lily Singh. And in case you couldn't guess, her male counterparts on this network television, Jimmy Kimmel and Seth Meyers, do not have quite the same energy. But not only do they not have the same energy, they also don't have the same content because Lily takes that late night television structure and she adds her own spin. What the boys do is they open up with political comedy, political satire, parody, and it's funny, it's great, but they do their bit and then they move on to the next bit. What Lily does is she takes a more personal route. She uses anecdotes and often she brings in her guests to the first bit. For example, she brought on Tyler Perry and she made a big joke about hire me, hire me Tyler Perry for your next movie. She brought out Adam Devine and they discussed embarrassing texts that they had both sent. So then what she can do is when those people come on later in the show for the interview, she can tie it back to that opening monologue and create a more unified experience for the viewer. And my third point today is that Lily does more than entertain us. By my definition, she's persuading us. By the book's definition, she is entertaining us. But what Lily is really doing is inspiring us. Lily does this in two ways. One is from personal stories from her guests, stories of rags to riches, of depression to success and joy but also her own presence being there. If you look or you read the interviews of Lily about this show before it started, she said that people need someone who looks like them, that girls need girls in successful places to inspire us. Lily's position here is literally to encourage a generation of girls to rise up and be funny, to be whatever they want to be. So to go over, consolidate, wrap up what we've talked about today. Lily Singh persuades us that women deserve to be in the comedy late night television spotlight. She does this by making the show her own, by making it something unique and totally her. What does that look like? 
One that looks like her high energy, her complete unashamedness to be totally herself. She is dancing, she is gasping, she is having a fun time. Second is that her content differs. She keeps the structure of a late night comedy show, but she adds a more personal touch and this is awesome because not only does it set her apart from the bunch, but it truly creates a more cohesive show than those other late night talk show hosts have. And third, her show is more than just a show, and this is truly what makes it so special, is that Lily's show does more than entertain. It inspires hope. It tells girls everywhere that they can do it, that they can pursue their dreams. As you can see, Lily Singh has truly touched my heart. So I guess she's completed her mission, at least for me. If you want to be inspired, if you want to see what Lily Singh is all about, you can watch her weekly. Every weeknight she is on NBC at 1.30 a.m. It's called A Little Late with Lily Singh. I hope you can take a look.